Hello everyone, my name is Van Hell and this is Gone Home Part 4. Alright, we're back inside the creepy house. We've uh, found a secret passageway and we found this and I've yet to open it. Okay, thank god. Alright, so we're gonna go, I guess, investigate now the creepy passage that's located in our parents' room. Uh, who, who freaking decides to put a passageway in their parents' room? Okay, god, look at all this wrecked stuff I did. Uh, okay. What the heck? What is all this nonsense? I'm like turning my head to read this stuff. Jesus. Oh, boring. I did, when I was editing, I did miss this, so. Uh. What? This is a bit of Oh, I, now I have to read this again. You get used to each other, you live your own lives in the same house, the kids grow up, they go away. Don't worry. Terry will be, will get over whatever is distracting him. Things go back to normal. And as for Sam believing, or Sam being distant, that's a teenager for you. Nothing to worry there. Or, nothing to worry about. In the meantime, though, this controlled burn, that sounds like a quite an adventure. Controlled burn. Uh oh, so this is a letter to the mother. Let's cut to the chase. This new ranger, they said... Uh, I'm hearing creaky noises, but I'm not going to freak out. Not yet. It's too early. <laughs> it's too early in the recording for me to freak out. Well, let's cut to the chase. This new ranger they sent. That is what I want to hear about. Ranger Rick. You have to be kidding me. It's too perfect. You have to tell me everything. And send pictures. I want the whole package. Wait, that sounds wrong. <laughs> Keep your chin up until Terry is out of his slump. And in the meantime, write more letters to your old friend Carol. She adores them. All right. Uh, apparently, Carol is this gossiping girl. Oh look, the ghost game. <laughs> okay, let's look at this, but let's look at it in, in broad daylight. Yeah, yeah. Oh, escape from ghost. Ah, oh, that's so creepy. Oh, that's so creepy. Who <laughs> does this shit? Who does this? Uh, that's no. We gotta, we gotta put it face down. Fuck you guys. <laughs> Fucking mom and dad. Why that? Okay. So let's just press map to go downstairs. Pull string. Well, oh, that didn't do shit. Uh, what's that say? Something about the box. Open, open panel. Oh. <laughs> What the fuck? Oh, what is this? Please, please. Okay. It looks like. Uh, okay. We have a third one. Hidden compartments found three. Library upstairs in the foyer. Foyer. Uh, evidence of the supernaturals with the S flying out. Discovered zero. <sighs> Okay, well, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Grab crucifix. <laughs> Dude, this is hella dark. What the? Uh, uh, please. We're in the. We're, we're back in here. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We have, we have, we have, we have, we have porn. Uh. Uh. <sighs> that's relaxing. <laughs> Okay, enough about that. So, that's odd. Alright, so I still found this, which is 0451. I feel it. Alright. Get out of here. What's this? The Misfits. It's another. It's another uh, thing for uh, Sam. Will I get audio? Yeah, I get audio. At Todd's brother's place after the show, there was only a futon to sleep on, so Lonnie and I shared it. Okay. 
the lights went out. Okay. I was turned toward her. Uh huh. My eyes started to adjust. Uh huh. And then I could see she was looking at me too. Alright. In the dark, she smiled. Don't judge. My heart was beating so fast. I rolled over. I felt so, I don't know, nervous. After a minute, she put her arm around me. Oh. And was so close and whispered in my ear, I really like you. I just nodded my head and I really hoped she could tell. Oh. I really hoped that she meant what I think she did. I felt like a shook up can of soda ever since. I hope we have the chance to talk before I explode. Alright, so Lonnie, I'm gonna guess, is a lesbian and Sam is conflicted. I guess, alright, let's. Oh man, alright, let's look at these hidden compartments. I found that one, there's one. I thought they said there's one in the foyer. No, no, I'm confused, I gotta go look back. Can I sprint in this game? No, I cannot sprint in this game. What's this? This is the. Okay, that's just. blah. <laughs> <laughs> That's just blah. Uh, this one? Yeah, throw on the ground. Private, do not read. What the hell? Party for Sam Privates. This looks like a ticket stub for. Ooh, that's like a ticket stuff or something. Half of Sam's locker combination. Oh, it's a locker combination. Heaven at the edge of primary does not read. <laughs> okay, let's see. Something about Amazons. This to be an Amazons, I believe. Alright, I'm gonna... Screw you, TV. You scared me for the last time. Have I ever tried this? Oh, hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. I found the combination. <laughs> Alright, let's get going. What was it? 0451? Oh, uh, that's right. 0451, oh, baby. Let's freaking hack inside this. Zero... Four, oh, four, oh, five, one. Ah, yeah. What? No! Please find close your original documents and a typed copy for your records. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so I guess this is attorneys at law. Attorneys at law. Well, in testament. Oh shit, dude! <laughs> I heard footsteps! <laughs> oh god, what the fuck? <laughs> That's not cool. Alright, let's. That was not cool reading a will and testament. Alright, let's try that again. Uh. Wait, awesome. okay, so when I was going back and doing my editing for this, uh, for the last episode, I realized that Oscar is actually the uncle's name. So, this is the last will and testament for the uncle that, I guess, died here? I don't know. I think he died. I'm pretty sure he died. Alright, that's my guess. I declare that I am a lifelong resident. I am unmarried and have no children. Okay. I declare that I have no outstanding debts to my name. Okay. I do hereby bequeath every item of value for which I may die possessed, including the dwelling and surrounding acres located at Arbor Hill, which is, I guess, is where we are. Personal property and mund accounts, moined accounts, to my nephew. Okay, and my nephew Terrence L. Greenbearer Jr. Alright. An event that said blah should predecease me, then such event the bequest to him shall fall in the same is bequeathed to his children as Offered by age and competence as steward of the state. Whoa. 
brain brain blast Jimmy Neutron style that is actually very peculiar what if our parents are dead what if we're the ones that actually own this house Sam and me Katie maybe that's why there's no family here could be possible that we we're actually the owners of this house now I don't know thinking ahead myself uh, I screwed up my name 13th block oh Jesus Christ okay so this is just I'll be surprised if something got lost in translation here at end you know the, the lawyer royally fucked up somewhere but we're gonna assume that the lawyer did a good job that is rather interesting that's a that's a hummer that's a humdinger right there okay I'm going back inside that creepy ass cave and I'm gonna see uh what else is there what's this Nothing. Bishop. Don't care. Oh, jeez. What is all this nonsense? It looks like old clippings from... From, like, the 80s or something. Okay. Library. Oh, I hear more noises. I hear more noises. Uh, look at this again. Library. My room. Okay, got it. Oh, let me up, let me up, let me up. Freaking run! God damn! Why do you have to walk through it? It's your freaking house, and it's freaking dark as shit. It's raining. This freaking possibility of ghosts. Your mom's room's been ransacked. How the hell? How the hell do you walk through it in the times like this? Give me this panel. Throw that panel on the ground. What is this? Ouija board? Respectively, put that on the ground. Oh god! <laughs> Don't kill me, Oscar. Okay. I guess that's the second half. Yes, we finally found the half. Hello? Hello? Just come by. That's not cool. Can I rotate the- Oh, man. Okay, we got a combination though, so... Uh, I don't know what the combination is. <laughs> a journal. Uh, one of these has to be... Items? Oh, there we go. There we go. What's this? 051. Zero fifty one. Oh, we got progress. What's this? She smokes. I guess that's that is my uh, my guess after seeing cigarettes in a uh, locker, a guarded locker. Gosh, Sam. Whoa, we're pouring. Except it's more, it's more about UFOs than some girl. That, again, is rather interesting. So I guess that, this is stolen stuff. She stole that stuff. What the heck? So our little Sam is a uh, little thief? A confused lesbian thief, I guess? Oh. Well, I right. came over today. But everything was different. Basically. She was sitting at my desk chair, and she wouldn't look at me. Finally, I asked her what was going on. She said she felt like she'd done something wrong that night in the city. Like I must think. But I said no. There was nothing wrong. I just wanted to say. But I couldn't find the words. I felt like I was going to cry, but I wasn't sad. She got up and sat next to me on the bed. I looked at her. Lonnie, do you think you could ever... And that's when she kissed me. Oh, okay. So, yeah. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> So going back, I just realized that this may be Lonnie. She served in the military. It's so odd. So I kind of wonder, like, actually, I probably can check that. Journals. Does it give me a date? It does give me a date. 19... It's 94. Shoot, what? When did this... 
Items, please tell me something. Passport. Uh, 95. A year. It's been a year. It's been a year since I guess this all starts. So... Oh, uh, my brain. I'm trying to like, process all this. We found a basement key and I'm gonna guess that basement key goes in here. Okay, I'm a scrub. <laughs> I don't know where this basement key goes. Items. Oh, two basement. Oh, that's a basement. Uh, okay, so we're, we'll, we'll go ahead and uh, look inside the basement in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like, favorite, subscribe. And uh, we're making some uh, steady progress. We're learning a few things. And I've come up with my own crazy theory if you haven't heard it. But, uh, yeah. So, until, you, until later, guys, uh, take care.